Welcome to an NC-105 Inside NC for Students training video. This video will demonstrate how to complete the first assignment in NC-105 emailing your instructor through your Pmail account. First, navigate to coursework using the link in the sidebar. Enter the assignment by clicking on the link. Once you've accessed the assignment, please read all directions very carefully and read all files that are included inside the assignment. The email address of the instructor is listed in the directions as well as what you should put in the subject line of the email. Once you have read the directions, click the student email link that you can find right here at the bottom of the sidebar on the left hand side of the page. This will open up a new tab and you can sign right into your Pmail account from here. To log in, type your first name dot last name at student.neosho.edu email address. In the case of Peter Panther, it would be peter.panther at student.neosho.edu. Then type in your password. If your account was created before March 15 of 2011, then your default password is NC and then the last four digits of your social security number. If it was created after March 15 of 2011, then it is Neosho, followed by the last four digits of your social security number. Please make sure that if you are not on your personal computer or personal mobile device, that the stay signed in box is not checkmarked. Then click sign in. Once you have accessed your email account, go to the upper left hand side of the page and locate the compose button and click it. A new box will pop up that will allow you to compose a message inside this box. Now just copy and paste the instructor's email address into the to box. To access the instructor's email address, navigate back to the course and reread the instructions. In step two, you'll see it says from your Pmail address, send an email to ncinstructor at neosho.edu. Highlight this text by clicking and dragging and then right click on the text and choose copy. Then come back up here and access your email by clicking on the tab and then right click in the to box and choose paste. Now we do the same for the subject line. Navigate back to the course, click and drag, right click and choose copy. Navigate back to your email, click in the subject line, right click again and choose paste, and there you have it. The directions do state that you do not have to type anything in the body, this part of the email. However, if you have questions, feel free to ask them. Then just click send.